I wonder to myself, when am I gonna have enough, right? I've been practicing criminal defense for 31 plus years. Who knows, by the time you're watching this, maybe even more. And I heard this great story from Edward Thorpe on Tim Ferriss' show. Ed was hanging out with Joseph Culler who wrote Catch-22. When you use that phrase, Catch-22, that was from this guy that wrote a book, Catch-22, and this guy actually had his book turned into a big famous movie, Catch-22. He made a lot of money off of the movie and the book and the this and the that. But Ed and Joe get invited to this hedge fund manager's party, and this hedge fund guy has multiple jets, he has multiple yachts, a zillion homes, and they go up to this home. Joe and Ed have both had quite a bit of success by my standards, they, you know, they go up to this ridiculous home and this hedge fund manager has a couple girls on each arm and just this really opulent place and a great, great party. Ed says to Joe, like all the movies you've done and all the books you've written, and you do know this guy makes as much as you've made in your life's work, he makes that in one day. So Joe's like, yeah, but you know, I have something that this guy doesn't have. And he's like, really? What do you got? Joseph Culler says, well, I have enough. I don't need to keep going. I don't need to have more and more and more. I have enough. And I thought that story kind of sank in with me. Like, I don't know when is enough for me. I have a bunch of different attorney friends that enough is a fourth Lamborghini, a fourth or a third Bentley or a hundred other things. I don't have those kind of things, but I understand that two really nice race cars is not enough for some people. I don't know where my line is. I don't know where your line is, but I like what Joseph Culler said that at least he has enough and he doesn't need more and more and more and more. I appreciate that.